Hello everyone, welcome to the playthrough of Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy for the PlayStation 4. Oh, up next is Temple Ruins. Oh, there's a special gem that I could have gotten. It's different. It was a green gem. Oh, this one looks pretty spooky. Oh, that's the last thing I need. All right. Oh, man. Ha, ah, you got him. It's kind of dark in here. Oh, I forgot. It was the first thing it showed me, and I had already forgotten. Checkpoint already. Huh. Oh. I don't need you eating me. Ugh. It is super dark in here, even with all this fire. Oh. Who made all these places? And what are they trying to hide? You know, for ruins, it's still pretty intact and active. <laughs> uh, okay. Is that where I'm supposed to go next? I think so, yep. Oh. Whoa! I almost jumped too soon. Alright, now I gotta be careful for him. I gotta wait for this fire. Uh, the vertical- or the- yeah, the vertical jumps up and down. Platforming is always so much harder because- oh! That's why. It's a lot harder to see how far you need to jump. Good thing I hit the checkpoint right here. Oh, almost stood there for too long. Whoa! Oh my goodness! I am too reckless when it comes to going through these places. I I don't know. I, I don't think I can go over there. As much as I want to. That sucks. I'm probably going to be missing out on something. Oh. Oh, they're going to drop. I missed the fruit, but that's not important. It's what it's the boxes. Oh, time to move on. There's no going back here. Unless I can step on it again. Can I? Oh, I can. But I don't want to. Oh, it comes back. Yeah, the back trailing in this game sucks. Just because the, the the locked camera. This is pretty cool, though. This little design. Why did they give you a burst of lives just in the middle of the game? Do they expect a lot of people to, to fail at those parts pretty often? That would make sense, but... I don't know. Well... Didn't make it. Whoa. His nose would have been flattened. <laughs> it sucks that there's that last jump there. I wonder how many people fell for that.
Yeah. Road to nowhere. Oh, this is the level. I, th I believe this is the level that people had problems with. <laughs> Let's see if I can fare decently in this one. Oh, how do they expect you to do that? Oh, wow. They really set you up for failure on that one. I already knew it. I jumped too soon. That's fine. Well, I had him anyway. I guess I could have stood right here. Nope, those instantly, those instantly drop. So that's what happened to me last time. Nope. All right, so I just got to look out for those. Now I should take the time to get those Wampa Fruit just to get the extra lives. You actually do need them if you're not a pro. That should be safe. Just want my camera before I start running. Oh, oh, there we go. Good thing they have a checkpoint there. Okay. The hint says that these hogs don't get hurt, so I'm gonna have to avoid them. Uh, whew. I don't know what that blue means. Maybe it's a safe place where the hogs don't touch. Oh no, that's ice. I definitely don't want to deal with that. Nope. Uh, I gotta hit the ice one first. Oh no, I'm back here. Should be okay though. All right, now he's coming back. Nope. Is, is that your sole purpose to just be an annoyance? Once I die, you just stop running around? Are you one of Cortex's animals? Or no, who's the uh, boss for this one? Who's my next, uh, next foe? that I have to deal with. Oh, nope. I stopped. I let go of the forward button for a second. Yeah, I can definitely see where this is an issue for a lot of people. I'm surprised this one didn't get removed. Are they just supposed to be deliberately difficult? There we go. Once you get it down, it's not too hard. Nope, 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 nope. Ah. So I can stay on there for a couple of seconds. I really need to use that to get more momentum so I can jump forward. But I get too scared and I try to jump and leave real quick. All right, easy enough. Looks like I got that section down pretty well. There we go. Just need to do a couple seconds to get me situated for the jumps. Oh! oh, man. I didn't know they would kill you. I thought they would just bump you. And besides, I was going to hit him, not the other way around. Ah, oh. they timed that. They set that up perfectly well, the designers. All right, I'm, I think I'm being too fast. I think I might actually have some time to wait him out. Yep, I do. I walked right on that broken platform. All right, so he comes when I step on here. There we go. Two. Okay, so she'll be coming up here pretty shortly. Oh, 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 
Watch out for that. Yep. Nice. That was a good jump. <laughs> All the space that I avoid. And I jump into the little crack. I kind of like this one. I know it's annoying, but I like the challenge. Whew, I made it. I guess it's a good thing they give you those extra lives. Ah, oh, I jumped too far forward. Nope, it's too short of a jump. All right. Uh, uh, I could have done a far jump, but I did not want to risk it. No, oh, come on. <laughs> oh. How do you even walk on a run on a bridge like that? There's not even a br this isn't even a bridge. It's just rope with planks like plank leftovers. Yeah, this is really hard. The difficulty spike is immense. Oh, ah, I jumped too late. Plus the icicle sloped down. Here. At least I can see his shadow on the air. So I can see where I'm gonna land. I guess they needed to give that. Jump him now! Oh! Oh! Uh. And this will be my checkpoint too. Nice. Still got seven lives. I didn't think I'd actually have to worry about lives in this game. Here we go. I like the little mechanics that they add like that. Oh, well, that was... I thought I missed one, but I forgot about the TNT. That was easy enough. They probably made it easy just to kind of give you a break. Oh no. I have to use you. This is only half the battle. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I think I can hit him. Yeah, I could, but I I thought I would roll him over. <gasps> nope. Are you are you just done? If you do that. All right, so I got to time this right. All right. I overjumped the turtle. I'm going to lose all my lives to this one turtle. Glad he's there already. I'm missing some? Oh well. Just get out of here. This place is a death trap. Oh, you know what? It's... You can't die. That's why. Oh, that was. That was fun. Definitely gonna have to come back and try to beat this game 100%. Next up is Boulder Dash. Boulder Dash. <laughs> hmm. I wonder how they thought about this game. Why? Why crash? Like, what was this? Like, what was their original thought process when they came to this design? for an adventure platformer, action adventure platformer game. I, I really am curious. I should really look into this game, look into the history and of the game and the company. Uh, I always just had so much fun playing this as a kid. And I still do, this game is still really fun. 
so colorful and vibrant and he's such an animated character. He doesn't talk, but who says you need to talk? <sighs> I feel like this is, you know, everybody, you know, there's so many genres out there for games. Oh, uh, the boulder just stops. Just all laws of physics just stop because my life ends or crashes life. He's the one getting thrashed around and abused. But there's so many genres and I feel like action adventure platformers are my thing. Oh man, I'm so scared right now. The boulder's getting closer. Man, you cannot let go of that down button. If you do, it just inches closer to you. Whew. I actually wasn't sure if it was gonna reach it or not. I frank frankly I just got greedy. Which we've seen how well that works out for me. Man, it's so fun jumping those. Like, when you get them consecutively in a row like that. Whoa! I don't even know what happened. Wait, but I fell to the floor. <laughs> I always wondered what was at the bottom of those pits. Oh, all right. Maybe I should use the... I'm gonna use the joystick this time. I've been using the D-pad mostly playing this game. Just because it allows for precision when it comes to jumping. But... It might be better if I do this because it'll allow me to keep forward while steering left and right. Although the, the thumbstick's really worn out so it's slippery. So it's actually kind of hurting my finger. But it's definitely allowing me to keep moving forward. I don't know what happened there. Oh, I could have easily killed myself. I didn't get the full jump when I was jumping up to get the box. I was still under an invisible wall. Oh, uh, nope. I messed me up. Whew. Does the boulder actually inch closer to you? Is it just because of the player error? It's probably just player error, because I, I doubt it actually comes closer, unless you stop running. This is actually pretty creative, the different, uh, the different levels. But if I didn't die, I could jump on this. Or I'm supposed to get the gem somewhere else. It's probably death, though. Hey everyone, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Before you go, would you be able to do me a favor and give me some feedback below by commenting and rating the video? And if you really like what you see and you want to see more, you could always subscribe. Thanks again, and I hope you guys take care.